Jura Micro, the smallest one-touch bean-to-cut machine in the world. This is a fantastic new product from Jura. I'm going to show you just what it can do. Tiny, tiny footprint, really, really small. Neat, even from back to front, it's very, very short, but it contains everything. Everything happens at a touch of a button. Here, I'm going to make an espresso. Touch a button, the beans that are contained in the back here are ground, delivers espresso. And what a lovely looking drink. Perfect result in the cup, or the glass, in this case I've used the glass, only to show how good the crema actually is. There it is, smooth, deep, really tastes absolutely great. If you want a longer coffee, then you can do that. Now here I can move the coffee delivery mechanism up and down to suit the height of the cup that it's in. So I'll move it up just a little bit, and I'll make a longer coffee. This is uh, what uh, a lot of people actually quite like these machines for, uh, that they can make a long black coffee as well as being able to produce really nice milky drinks, which I'll show you in a minute. The um, Jura have been making domestic machines for a long time, so everything is a sort of culmination of their understanding of what the customer really wants. And the micro really sums everything up. It's got a special feature which is enabling it to make really, really fine milk foam. So, having made our long coffee for the first member of our family or friends or whoever it is, and there is our long black coffee. Looks absolutely great in the cup. And there is our long black coffee. Looks absolutely great in the cup. We are going to move on to make our next drink, which is going to be the cappuccino, the most popular of all the drinks that these machines produce. Again, it's one touch of a button to produce the drink. I simply press the button on top. You can program this machine to produce the size and the strength of drink that you actually want. Of course, I've done it for a, this particular size of cup, which is the normal cappuccino size cup. And it's producing micro foam. This foam is really absolutely beautiful. It's thick, but it's got very, very small bubbles so that uh, the coffee just settles on it so beautifully. The little uh, flask at the back can be, uh, on the side rather, can be bought. Um, it's very convenient and neat way of storing the milk. It's a thermos flask effectively, but just matches the color of the machine. And here it's delivering coffee on top of the, that beautiful foam I spoke about. I can't wait to have a look at this and show it to you. It is just absolutely fantastic. I only just hope that our little video we're doing now can show the quality of this foam, because I promise you that of all the machines that I've ever used to make foam, this is absolutely the best. It's gorgeous. I really want to drink it and not talk to you when I'm making the film. It, by the way, I'm not actually finished, because it can actually make a latte macchiato as well. Fantastic with such a small machine. I'm going to use a glass for this. Latte macchiato is a, is a milky drink. Um, but effectively um, it actually separates the milk and the coffee. So by simply pressing a button, again, I'm going to generate the foam. The machine then draws the milk from the milk flask, puts it into the glass, and then lets it settle for a short time so that the layers of the coffee and the milk become marked, macchiato marked, creating the most beautiful visual effect in the drink. I should also mention that the machine has got, uh, I did mention the machine has got beans, but also you can use this machine with ground coffee as well. So if you've got some people that want to uh, use uh, decaffeinated uh, coffee, for example, because they don't like caffeine, then simply by moving a flap on the top of the machine, we can have exposed a little um, 
charcoal, and what it will do is it will enable us to spoon the decaffeinated ground coffee in, into the machine, and it will use that for making the drink. You notice there was a pause after it finished delivering milk before the coffee came out, and that's to allow the layers to settle. But just look at the result that we've created in this glass. Look at those layers. Fantastic result. I'm going to put that on the side just for a moment and we'll let the layers just settle so you can actually see just how good that is. And for those people who say, I want to know how to clean this machine because I've heard that milk clogs up coffee machines, just look at this. I just press those two buttons on the side and I can take off and wash the mechanism that foams the milk very easily pop it back on the machine and it's ready for use again. So this is the Jura Enna Micro. It is the smallest one-touch cappuccino machine in the world. Now you've seen it for yourself. Please speak to us. My name is Bob from Fairfax Coffee. We are authorised Jura distributors and dealers and we'll be pleased to give you more information about this wonderful machine.